Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to show you how to disable your Steam input. And you're probably wondering, why would you want to disable your Steam input? It's because games from Insomniac, I think those are the ones I, re I know, um, Spider-Man Remastered, Miles Morales, Ratchet & Clank, those PC ports, when you install them on your Steam Deck, uh, your controller, so the Steam Deck controller I'm using here, it doesn't work. And I think everyone has this problem. And I've done a video in the past, uh, you need a Bluetooth controller, and I did it with the uh, Nintendo Switch controller, Switch Pro controller, and a lot of people say they have issues with the DualSense. So in this video, I'm going to use the DualSense controller um, to disable my Steam input and make the Steam control work, alright? So we need to get prepared for Spider-Man 2. See, now the game's booted up, and yeah, I can't... I can't use the control. That's normal, all right? So what you need to do is you need to connect your Bluetooth controller. So go in, press the Steam button here, and then go to Settings, Bluetooth, Bluetooth on, show your devices. I'm going to make my Bluetooth the Dual Edge on pairing mode. Oh, I think it's, yep, it's in, it's glowing blue. So I think it's in pairing mode now. So let's wait for it. Okay, found it. Dual Sense Wireless Controller. Okay. So let's connect. Let's connect it. Is it connected? Yeah, I think so. Okay, connected. Alright, still I can't move. But I go into the controller settings. Controller settings. You can see I've got Steam Deck and PS5 controller, alright? So on the PS5 controller, go to the gear button here and then disable steam input all right and then let's confirm and all right let's see let's see if it works okay yeah it's still here you might have to press it a few times this always happens it doesn't directly so okay now Let's quit the game. Exit the game. Okay, and then go to the controller here. And then PS5 controller. Let's see. It's still not disabled. Okay, maybe we have to reset the machine. All right, let's see if we reset the machine. It will be okay. Okay, let's restart. Okay, let's wait for it to restart. I think you have to restart now. Before, we didn't have to restart. You just had to do it a few times. But yeah, let's do it now. Yeah, so like I was saying, Spider-Man 2 is coming out on the PlayStation 5 it's very soon. And yeah, we've got to get prepared. It might be a few years before they bring out the PC port. But yeah, once the PC port comes out, I'm pretty sure it's got to have the same problem because it's an Insomniac game. So if you have other games that aren't from Insomniac and you know you require to disable Steam input, please let me know in the comments. I just let wait for my Steam Deck to reboot. Okay. Taking some time. Just wait for it. Be patient. Okay, I can hear the sound. The signal's not coming out yet. Okay, now, it, now it's there. Okay. So, if I still want to use my... Can I still use it? Can I just press the... Can I press the PS button and wake it up? No, maybe not. Maybe not. Okay. So now, let's go back. Let's go back and... Bluetooth. Oh, it's paired. Is it connected? It's paired but it's not connected that's weird okay let's disconnect it not connected it's connected now yeah it's connected now okay so let's open up spider-man again controller all right see how the dual sense it's now says enable steam input that means that I've disabled it, all right? 
So now let's boot into the game. Okay, external controller translation. Yeah, okay, just press OK. Boot into the game and then see what happens. Okay. Oh, that was a bit of a stutter there. Okay. I'm not getting anything. Okay, here. Would you like to recap the events? Oh, I can use my Pro Controller. So this is working on the Pro Controller. See this? I'm uh, pressing up and down. Yeah, this works. So does the... Does the... Okay, the Switch Controller works too. See here? I'm pressing down. What about the button? Alright. So yeah, that's how you get it to work. That's how you get it to work. Start. All right, so I'll leave it here. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.